consejero de Sharon en 2001, ¿verdad? As Ariel Sharon's former spokesman, Avi Pazner, had a close relationship with the former Israeli leader. He spoke to Euronews about his memories of the man he considered a great friend and defender of the Jewish state. How the decisions he took, Mr. Sharon, shaped today's Israel? You know, the history of Mr. Sharon is parallel to the history of the state of Israel. First, there were the military struggle for the very existence of the state of Israel in the 50s, the 60s, and the 70s. And Sharon was the one to turn the tide of the war in 73, the Yom Kippur War, when he crossed the Suez Canal. And then when he entered politics, he understood slowly, slowly, slowly that it was not enough to win on the battlefield. You have to win also the battle for peace. And like Sharon always did, he did a great gesture towards the Palestinians and toward the Arab world when he decided the withdrawal from the Gaza Strip. Unfortunately, afterwards, he could not continue because he was struck. And a few months later, he fell ill, and he was ill for many years. But his legacy is one. This of determination to win in periods of war and the determination to take the hard decisions in period of peace. This is Ariel Sharon. Thank you very much. The last one, in two words, very, very quickly. How are you going to remember him? First of all, I remember him as a great man and then as a friend. A great man because one has to be lucky to work with people like that, like Ariel Sharon. And then as a friend, because um, he didn't look like that, but he was very sensitive, very friendly, very warm, and very thoughtful. And I had a pleasure every day I worked with him and a great admiration until today.